this video answers the question, what do I do when I've sent out a mailing with the wrong link? Uh, so quite often you'll have either sent out a MailChimp or some other EDM that's got a link to your site, only it's the wrong link, or else somewhere out there on the web there's a link that you can't change but is now going to either an obsolete product or a dead page or just the wrong page on your website. Um, the good thing is with Shopify, we can fix that. So what you do is you go into your admin area and go to your online store. Once you're in there, down to navigation on the left here. Then once you're in navigation, up at the top here, where it says add menu, just to the left there's URL redirects. And what that means is basically I redirect links. So you click on that. And then what you'll see is in the past this has been used for redirecting links on an old, old version of the site to your new site. You can also use it for fixing this sort of problem. So there's the bad link. Uh, back into our... Now just be aware that you need to cut out everything, cut out the domain. So it will always start with a slash and then blogs, etc. Oh, I just searched rather than adding. I'm going to add or path. So once again, just make sure we've got the site. And then once again, where does it go to? Where it goes to doesn't really matter if it's got the prefix or not. I'm just going to do this to make it a little more fault tolerant, but you can put the whole link in if you want to. Add URL redirect. And what you'll find, I'm just going to give an example of what'll go, what would have gone wrong if we hadn't fixed it. Um, should have shown this first, shouldn't I? So if you go to the site, um, this was a broken link. That's what you would have got, but because we fixed it, it now goes to the right place. So that's a really useful Shopify technique for fixing all sorts of broken links. Enjoy.